Okay, we're here playing RTSL against Derek Miller. We're playing as the USA and our hand is pretty garbage. Um, yeah, this is really, really bad. Um, yeah, this is ridiculously bad. This is a terrible T1 hand, I really don't like it. Middle East is luckily good, and Cambridge 5 didn't do anything, so that's good. Um, but now they probably defect me. I'll do anything, uh, defect, uh, decall, I'll do anything interesting, and I'm probably just done for. Uh, that's NATO for the coup, that's good, expected. Actually, didn't do the huge succeed thingy. We're just gonna go for Mosin into Malaysia and Lebanon. Yeah, sure. Keep presence in the Middle East, even if they have Suez. Make AI wars slightly less positive. Yeah, the alternative is the UN blockade, but that's never great, I feel. Can't even space anything. This is truly one of the worst hands I've had. I mean, it obviously isn't the worst hand imaginable, since I've got cards I can actually play. But it's getting close. At least I didn't get perched. A perch here would have been really annoying. Although, well, there goes Truman. Very annoying, but it is what it is. And they did set up for five, which is interesting. I think we are going to. How do we coup? Um, perhaps we do coup. I mean, we need to coup. Special is not worth it, so we might as well coup Afghanistan. Sure. Give me access. <laughs> I'll take it. I'll take it. Cooing is a net positive for us since we don't have a lot of ops. Nasser also wants to be cooed out at a certain point, and especially with Millie's squad, it's not that disastrous. But it appears their hand isn't as ridiculously great either, I think. Not sure. If I want to spend three ops in France and two ops in Thailand, and then perhaps one op somewhere else in there. Okay. So we're gonna leave South Korea for what it is. Um I mean we can just coup things. There's no reason not to coup things. We could coup North Korea. Make that annoying. Um no different world, why are they not cooing? And the obvious answer is they have things to lose. I need no ops. Um, what does this realistically do? I mean, what it realistically does is it gives them that and do that. I think we're doing this. If we do roll the six, then we're happy go lucky. Now let's see whether they have any of their good cards. Because mm, I can't I can't take Thailand to keep it uh, regardless. But popping two into and giving them the coup. Okay, their hand is they don't have any of the good cards, but they are spacing defectors, which is interesting, I must say. Very interesting indeed. So, I feel like I should still... Uh, the thing with Thailand is, I technically want to get it to 4, which is a lot, but I also want a coup. 
Ooh, let's see, eh? So, here we have Containment and Korean War. Okay, okay, okay. Good to know. Um, is there anything they can really do? Not really. So, I'm just gonna coup in Iraq. Throw a six. <laughs> Okay, got some luck on my side this time. Uh, hands were pretty weird. I feel like they could have done more with that hand of theirs. The misroll on NATO, that was a 2, isn't it? Uh, yeah, definitely didn't help. Okay then. So, um, we're probably spacing Nasa here, and just popping one into Thailand. Yeah, I am rolling hot for sure, but it's the second attempt at that. It's one in six, but, well, try enough and you'll eventually get there. I wonder whether they give me containment or not. Uh, if they do not give me containment. Um, I'm just gonna play Nasser in Thailand. Uh, they do give me containment, which means I can space Nasser, which I think is better. Oh, that's annoying. Do we now give up Nasser? Yeah, I think we do. Um, I think we just, with the goal is gone, so obviously there's still Suez, which is annoying. But the goal is gone. So what do we do here? I think we just pop two into France. With Nasa. It makes it not takeable with a four up. Unless they also have Suez. Um, definitely possible. Okay. New hand, new ideas. Purge is definitely a play here. Um, and I have ops later on. But yeah, this is an easy perch. CNS is obviously good, but probably potentially hold. Warshock gets played. Ooh, socialist governments. I didn't think of that. That's also very annoying. Um, luckily, this makes that a bit more manageable. I can break or try to break things. Let's see. Um, that is annoying. We've got no scorings, which is the good part. I think Vietnam is also very nice. But yeah, they're gonna do a number on Europe, which is annoying. Especially with Truman being out already. Um, I mean, the logical thing is they removed two from France and then one from West Germany, I suppose. Mm. I don't have a double 4-up. That being said, that's assuming they actually have a 4-up, where with only NTB and Marshall Plan being in the deck left, and that might not be... Well, there's always China. It's always China. They did have NTB. Very annoying. Um, I want to take Spain-Portugal for sure. Probably start. Well, there's a coup still. I want to take Spain, Portugal. Do we just take West Germany? Do we break France to threaten Algeria? Do we coup Egypt instead? We know they've got Korean War. So that's the weird thing. I think we just do this. We break France, give us access to that. Um, they don't have as many ops. Um, Korean War is probably going to be used for the event. I'll definitely want to do this. Um, uh, if I can, I have a coup. Vietnam is a last AR thing, probably. Um, I mean, the decal still around. It's definitely not something I don't I mind. I don't need to coup. Um, since decal is around, it's 
probably better for me not to immediately coup. I do want to get into Iran, Pakistan. A lot of things I want to do. CNS as usual is a very good card, but hmm. Five year plan. They do have duck and cover. Um, which might have been their original plan. Use duck and cover to drop DEFCON and take France, but then obviously with my RSP play that was impossible. Um, it's probably still a good idea just to... yeah, there it goes. Um, ooh. They do do that. So, are we going to push them there? Are we just going to push them more and more? Mm. No, I think at this point, I think I'd rather just take Algeria and Angola and then go into Iran soon after. Zaya. I'm not giving up Warsaw yet, since NATO has passed, special relationship has as well, and there's the obvious threat of uh, diesel, which, yeah. There's also IP was still around. Europe scoring, Asia scoring, all that scoring's in the deck still. There's the event I was thinking of, which means I can play Warsaw, which is nice. Although, perhaps I shouldn't, not sure. Okay, so... We are going to Colombia for sure. Gonna go into Colombia. Gonna take West Germany back. To point. Uh, there's so many things to do. They haven't gone here, which I find slightly surprising. I think I would have popped one of these things into Pakistan. Um, it's so open, it's so free. It's annoyingly so free. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm starting to lack ops, which is very annoying. I wonder whether I even should. Because I can't. They have Korean War, they can event. That's the simple truth of the matter. Perhaps we just go Columbia 1 and take Pakistan. It is surrounded by this. Is that good enough? Would IP was still around? I feel like it might just not be good enough. Mm -hmm. Perhaps this is the wrong card. It's not really the wrong card. This is a bug. Um, perhaps this is just a play. Or yeah, I think this is just a play. Sure. It's a bit of an defensive side, but yeah, I think it's fine. Definitely want to get back into the Middle East decently taking Iran and things like that, but it, it's, it's such a weird situation currently. And this is one thing I did notice with my play in general, is that I'm losing, I'm, I'm up-tempoing in the sense that I play my high value cards quite early on, and then I don't have my low value left. They do have some influence. Um, I feel like I should just attack this. Can't have Suez on top of that, right? <laughs> uh, probably do. Might do. Um, and even if they don't, I don't have EU nor or anything in that sense, so I can't take it. The main idea is that I'm preventing them from doing fun things, which is also very important. I feel like I shouldn't give them Fidel, but at the same time, perhaps I should give them Fidel. That's Marshall. My god. They did have Marshall. 
has a lot of ops. Very annoying. Uh, but let's protect these. And make sure that never ever happens. I think yeah, we definitely don't really want to give them Vietnam right now. I think we're just going to space Fidel. Get rid of it. Is Asia scoring? Good, fine. And let's get this out of my hand as well. Okay then. I got Ikewa. Cute. They've got in UNR, Europe scoring. I got Suez. They also have Decal and some other lovely cards. Still holding Korean War, which is very interesting to me. There's the factors. Um Comic on and ooh, UN. UN Suez isn't the worst. Is there any reason? That they might headline something strong. I mean, there's decal. I'll take no to decal there. Mm. It's a redraw, so. Mm. But decal loses me Thailand. I don't want to lose Thailand, so. Very easy solution to that problem. Um, question becomes what can I do in South America ever? The answer is not a lot. Unless I draw any of the good cards next turn, or turns or thereafter. Also depends on the scoring and things like that. I'm assuming they might just headline Europe scoring. Yeah. The reason for decal, which they did, is that it's a redraw and it gives them Thailand. And now they don't have Thailand. Nor Nigeria, for the matter. Angola, South Africa, getting access there, it's, it's very good. Denying them access there, is probably even better. So, um, we probably just want to go Iran, Pakistan at this point. I know they've got Europe, but they can't contest it. And I think that's one of the reasons why Europe should be the thin. There's Korean War for a coup, going Angola. That's quite fine. So, we want to threaten. Nigeria for sure. Um, can we break anything here in a reasonable fashion? Not really. So, probably want to pop. I mean, I need to start just filling here. You know, these regions are mine. I should take them. I should take the other living sh crap out of them. Um, should definitely also go to seven states. There's Asia scoring again. Wow, that's a bad hand on the other side. And now I get a point. Oh yeah, that's true. It was equal because of Afghanistan. Very convenient. So now we'll pressure them with uh, Comic Con probably. Yeah. Comic Con just Saharans. No. Yeah. I think just Comic Con into Iraq, man. Mm. Um, fairly certain we play UN here. I might space twice. It's that. And we have two more ops to use, which is not a lot. Mm. Would want to go to Nigeria. There's no. Reason not to go to Nigeria. I would want to take Mexico, Panama, things like that. Um, yeah, again, I don't really want to see Vietnam's going. Them not having access to that entire region is so good for me. Um, I should take Southeast Asia. I'm not taking India. Um, there's no reason for that. Not overprotecting Pakistan probably either. Um, because again, yeah, little reason to do that right now. I think a next move is probably UN Suez, well, or a Vietnam Revolt in space. The UN Suez to Laos, Cambodia, Indonesia, something like that, and Saharan states. Probably works quite well. Mm. 
fingers for Mosin. Intriguing. They still have China. Mm -hmm. So, okay. perhaps independent rats is the card to play. Yeah, independent rats probably is the card to play. If they coup, I don't need to use Indo-Paki Wall. I can just coup with Indo-Paki Wall instead. Against Europe's scoring, they still have. It's perfectly fine. So I use you and Suez to Nigeria and Panama and probably just Malaysia. Suez isn't that bad, but yeah, I currently have a decent position on France, which is cute. Mm -hmm. Vietnam goes to space. Ideally, it's not the worst if it doesn't, but yeah, I really just want to keep that out. They don't really have anything left to get in there um, currently. There goes EU and all. Um, yeah, just because it doesn't matter much. Taking Greece might not be a bad idea against Brush War, but then again, it's the fourth battleground. It doesn't matter as much. I can take Greece, Turkey, Canada if that would happen. But like Thailand is a way bigger threat at that point. So I'm gonna space this. Fail. This isn't the worst. It's 2 VP, yes, but it's not the worst. They've got two cards left. One of them is Romanian Education, one of them is Special Relationship. They will put to space. I will take two VP. Ooh, two more. Very nice. Ooh, this hand is interesting. So, Opec is worth three, so it's probably not something we want. Neither is we will bury you. I think this is just a simple. Uh, the thing is, if they have missile Enfi, um, then popping. How I learned makes me makes me win. I think how I learned is better. A bit more ops rich. Yeah, let's do this. That's liberation theology. Cute. I'm popping it to five. That's liberation theology. Specifically putting to five. Because this gives me an interesting real line on France, which is scored, yes, but, mm. um, but most importantly, I can play We Will Bury You now without too much worry. And then I've got an additional 4 drop, which I do like. There's OPEC. Mm, Nixon. I do like Nixon. Some Not the worst hand. Mm. Not the worst hand. I could see them cooing Thailand here. Um, but in this case I could coo back. And the like result is that I... like uh, it's, it, it's a dice roll at that point. But mm. Advantage for me is that this makes Africa very nice. Interesting bit is that they can take Mexico. as in Panama. Ooh. They play Missile Envy for the event. Yes, we will bury you. There you go. So now we are cooing. Um, what are we cooing? Are we cooing Central America? Are we cooing Zaire? I think we're cooing Zaire here, right? Um, like, odds are just so much better. Yeah. There goes Missile Envy. Uh, good things, good things. Yeah, that's that's the price I pay for not picking up on Mexico. At the same time, this is a very stable hold currently. Um, I would want to take Saudi Arabia. 
sooner rather than later. Because that gives me three points for domination and an additional battleground. We did see a Iowa. No, no, no. That wasn't T2. And there's a coup with you too. Coup in Nigeria. Okay, in that case, I will just do the very simple Panama Cameroon play, forcing them to do something cool. And I think a Latin American that what's. Um, well, Willy could go. To, well, with Opec in hand, Willy never goes to space, does he? Could be one of the two cards I hold. Could be that around. So, yeah, let's do this. Advantage of this play is also that arms race is very unusable for them, which is good. I mean, quite likely they're just taking Ivory Coast. Oh, they're just taking Africa scoring, which they have. Three game. Now the, qu the question becomes, do we space OPEC, well, or Willy, or then, well, OPEC? Not. I think 3VP is too much to give away. Mm. I do like playing Nixon. I do like taking three here just gives a lot of power. I do want to take Middle East. Um, I think something like this is quite nice. I want to start taking Southeast Asia, playing into Middle East, they're actually popping China here, very interesting, indicating to me that they don't really have a lot of things going. Um, I think we're plopping you here, hmm, ideally we would use a 3-op, but I don't really have a good 3-op, so Willy it is. I need to remember three more plays. What's my hold here? Could be Nixon. Could be the Pope. Pope is a good headline. Could just be OPEC. If I don't feel find the time to space. I would like to space because one small step is obviously in the deck. And a card to be considered. They still have this card. I mean, education. Ooh, that's big. For me at least. Middle East. There's also J to consider. Um, I'm not gonna worry about this too much. Probably using Paul. I mean, the Pope attacking Poland is quite nice. There goes Pope's space. A card I would have wanted. But, um, so, um, yeah, we take Vietnam and Indonesia, right? I would like to take Guatemala. Something like this, then instead. Mm, I think that's a good loss they are, right? So perhaps we just space OPEC. There we go. OPEC to space. And I'm probably just use JP2 to grab some more in Southeast Asia. Make the scoring very beneficial for me. Uh, South America obviously is a hole. Um, I think I'm fine with that. Got Junta or Brush War or ABM, one of the big, then that would be cool. Let me go Quagmire for the last year. That's fine. Oh god, that's not fine. Okay. Um, at least I've got cards to drop to it. Somewhat. Um, could ask not. Could pop Central America scoring, but that's very dangerous not knowing what they're doing. Um, yeah, ask not, I'd love to hold for South Africa, South America, sorry, South America. Um, is this a risky five-year plan? What is that to hit? 
mean, they don't have China, nor do they have that. Uh, but CIA has been played. Yeah, but some cards could still be annoying. I mean, most of this is playable. Che is very annoying, yes. But Cultural Allende is playable. The Goal is playable. Lots of playable things here. I don't really want to ask not. And the question is, what do we do? I think we just play 5 Yippa. Oh, there goes Fidel. Annoying. Oh my, that's very big. Whoa. That's that's ridiculous. Um, yeah, not, nothing else to say there. Um, very big play on my end. I'll probably lose Panama. Mm. Alone, gunman is still in there somewhere. Oh yeah, Che is gonna go get him eaten by Quagmire, which hopefully will then end. Um, weird that I'm not... Well, no, I will be dropping it if Central America scoring, if, if they really overtake Panama. Uh, yeah, yeah, Panama. Um, which, honestly, seems very likely. Uh, Zayek, who is also still good. Almost everything is scored except for Southeast Asia and Central America. And I have Central America in my hand. It's only turn five. It's quite early. Two scorings here. Oh, two scorings here as well. Uh, Europe only came out once. It was good. It's good for me, although it's not that Europe is that bad of a shape. There goes AI War for Coup. That's cute. And they do Coup here. Che, we fail again. Okay, use kitchen debates to coup. I don't think it's no, it's never active. Uh, Colombia. I want. Uh, I want to go out. It's fine. Hey, look, they get the good things. That's probably Panama. If it fails, oh, nope, it doesn't. Yeah, so at this point, um, probably gonna. There's some things I would want. Brezhnev is free, so I'm not dropping Brezhnev. Cultural is not free, but it's probably good to drop that. Yeah, yeah. Discard all of this. Um, you know what? No. Well, uh, I need to consider. I'm just gonna use. <laughs> I think cultural could be very nice here. Use cultural, grab Guatemala. Nah, I don't. I don't like it. Don't like it. No, I should. Uh, I'm dropping cultural. Wow, yeah, get rewarded. Um, that's ridiculous. That's more stuff to mine, which is nice. <laughs> oh, yes, it's actually a card I can play. Probably lost. Well, I've got Brezhnev lost there already. Oh, yes, I sent probably my hold card here. Yeah. Well, that's Southeast Asia scoring. Very annoying. I wanted to score that for more. That being said, right now is the time to realign some things, I assume. Um, so, let me use this to realign Nigeria. Come on. There we go. The alignment's going my way. What is this game? Um, taking Israel would be quite nice. Um, yeah, salt for additional brush. 
for initial that would be cool. Can take the space is annoying. Fine. Filter wall, just good for me. Um, I'm not gonna play Nixon. And take this and start filling in the eye, I suppose. They might have a Zuri, which is definitely a thing should be aware of. Should fear. Ooh, that's got a little bit of gas. I like that. Because it gives me um here, right? Mm. Yes. Just it's not that bad, but it's just four ops for me, which is quite good. Um I will definitely play ABM since VP. I'm not sure what I should queue. These are atrocious, obviously. Um, queuing Africa is obviously more stable. And that's that. Last hour is that, so ABM gets played for the event now. So do we coup Zaire? Do we coup Mexico? Mexico has a return on well, it fails half the time. Zaire always always wins. And becomes very tough to, to crack. I like this. I think I've got OE yes to really bug them out a bit as well. Both of these are really... Oh wait, I do have this to coup. So I could coup with Brezhnev. Hmm. I think this is still right. Do we take the roll in Central America? Or do we say no, we go for Zaya? I think we just go for Zaya. Roll would have worked. Pity. But I'm also fine with four in Zaya. I think this puts pressure on them here. In a way that I don't believe. I don't necessarily like it. Ooh, that's nuclear subs for a coup. We can brush enough and just take the entirety of Angola. Um, no. I think at this point we coup Mexico. And this allows me to actually take it with OAS, which would be cool. It will also allow me to pop two into Brazil or Argentina probably. Who Junta is very tempting, but like ridiculous. So we do have Lone which is very annoying. Hmm. <laughs> Alternative is Cuban Missile Crisis isn't a good headline. Interesting to deny Lone Gunman, but that's it. And Junta or OAS are the obvious headline targets. Bear Trap, but again, I don't really want a Bear Trap right now. Um, VOA is unseen. I want them to deal with it rather than just give it away to the trap. Their trap could be good, uh, last they are. Portuguese Empires is fine, it's good to have. It's just Junta, there's not a lot else to do. Ooh, there's salt. Salt got hunted. Um, Probably popping to in Argentina, queuing Mexico. I think that's the thing to do. Oh, they grab RSP back. I wonder whether they immediately use it or not. Two in Argentina, and we coup. Uh, do we do coup Mexico? We could coup Colombia instead. Um, pop. A realignment threat on France, which means they can't just fill, right? That might be correct. Also, Lone Gunman's free, thank the heavens. Which means if I could now they coup, I need to give up Lone Gunman. So I think we just. I think this is still correct. It's Hunter. Um, I'm giving up Lone Gunman, basically always. Uh, get it out of the deck. Out of my hand, out of my heart. Yeah. 
and it's nice to have Portuguese is fine, Olympics is whatever, progress is fine. So we know they have RSP. RSP would be annoying, definitely. But I think they lose a lot of tempo when they do that. Because I could still take Mexico and Argentina. I'm surprised they took RSP and not ABM. I think I would have taken ABM. It's a guarantee coup on Nigeria or Zaire with a light. That's quite high. Mm. Yeah, this game will depend on whether any of these scorings come back quickly or not. South America, Central America is still very much in my disadvantage. Um, breaking it slightly. If I roll, well, if salt wasn't a thing, the four would have been enough. And um, it was, so it doesn't matter. VOA would be a lovely card to get. I didn't, but. Mm. That's a life. <laughs> Ooh, they do go for influence and TP again in their hand. Taking Mexico back, popping one to Argentina. Which means I think I am just going to use this. And then One here. Don't think they will I mean immediately. Oh, one in Guatemala. Don't like that yet. No, oh, yeah, that's good. Go, go, Japan. Japan back into the deck before the shuffle. Nine cards still in there. Quite a lot of good blue cards, um, but also Muslim Revolution, Flower Power, Socialist Governance, Cambridge Five, and South African Unrest. Um, South African Unrest, which isn't that threatening, but will be annoying. Um, so yeah, next move is probably either taking one of Paraguay or Uruguay, um, or breaking Chile, in a worst case scenario, defense. Um, probably gonna use Alliance for Progress, for Ops. <laughs> We're not really keen on using that. I mean, ideally we use Alliance for Progress to grab Paraguay um, or Uruguay and, uh, and Guatemala at this point. Um, but we'll see. We do need to fill up Asia, which is a lot of points. Four additional bonus points. There's stuck and cover. Very nice. It's VP for me and a coup for them. Not so nice. I can't use that thing. So Lone Gunman's back to being in my hand. Not cool, but yeah. I think we do what? I don't take Paraguay of Saya. Mm, I don't wanna I don't wanna do that. I think I like this this better. And this makes it a bit more of a problem. And I have OAS to do some funky stuff if necessary. Bear trap, OAS and headline. That could be some really nice really nice things. Um oh yeah no, we'd be holding Lone Gunman true. For most of been played, um, but I don't think it matters much. That's our speed just for influence, which is yeah, taken. They're going for Israel, but Egypt will be mine at some point. Um, I think we realign out of Angola now, though. Do we not? Or do we set up more? Uh, no, we need to play at 3, which is fine. I'll play at 3. Cuban Missile Crisis out of here. Again, ideally I bear trap plus they are. The way I could get rid of Lungan without a hitch. Um Oman and Tehran. Let's see. Hmm. No. Um, 
solid by flower power. So flower power is South African unrest and solid are gone, which I like very much. Still need a coup as well. Yeah, they're cooing Guatemala right now, I'm assuming. Oh my. Um, yeah. Gonna realign things. Look at that. Suddenly light. Light at the end of the tunnel. This game has been in my favor, I must say. Uh, it's definitely a truth. Lone Gun is one of the things that can s royally screw me over still. I have China though. Cultural has gone. Um, still socialist, but... Hmm. Um. This is very annoying for them. Um, hmm. This inclusivity is annoying, but I mean, oh yes, it's definitely better spent popping two into Chile, I think. Well, it's about bear trap, right? Perhaps we don't bear trap last year. Perhaps that's not something we do. Perhaps we... Oh yes! Last hour. And now we could... Columbia? Um, South African states. Oh, the Saharan states as well. Just an annoying coup. No, oh, let's not do Colombia. I'm not there dropping them anytime soon. We will be playing OAS because OAS is nice and shiny. There's a bunch of things you can still do that's annoying. On three is three VP, which is nice for them for sure. Ooh, they need to Usuri. I like that. This means I can take this. And Korean War wasn't removed, right? Oh, it wasn't. It is discarded because they held it. Um, so, hmm. Taking this, breaking this. Just breaking both of them better? No, it's not because we do want India. Interesting that they... What did they space? Shuttle over... Huh. Okay then. They got VOA. Hurrah. I got Cuban Missile Crisis, which is interesting. Central America has come back. I have Korean War. Um, I have UN, which is great with London. Okay, so I got Musraps, Panama. They have Subdart, which is annoying. And Green Cells, also annoying. But this means Cuban Missile Crisis makes their hand pretty annoying. So that's exactly what we will do. Right, there's no better. There's Camp David, which is good. Not necessarily the best. Um, question mark. Cuban Missile Crisis makes it so... Well, they're still not going to play either of those, right? Yeah, I think this is Camp David. This. So, redraws Cuban Missile Crisis. Ooh, that's Junta. Should've played that. Well, I think it's fine. Um, we've got Central America scoring, which at this point we just score for two. It's two, right? That's two. Definitely fine with that. Wonder what they will target. South America is in turmoil, so I would assume they go for South America here. Yeah. Um, oh, they're just going that. 
intriguing. They know I've got lone gunmen. Why would you not lower everything? It's no real way of me winning on points right now. So I'm not going to be too busy looking for that. Most reps is obviously not really going anywhere. There's a Lats coup. Understandable. Uh, understandable. I want to take the sill probably. Uh, set up quite a lot of realignments there against me. That's now annoying. You and that. Oh, this is overprotected as well because of that. That doesn't matter anymore. Um, do we do that and then force them to realign? Yeah, I think we do. I think we do. Wait, they know I've got Norad and I'm never gonna play Norad for the event, so I should play Norad here. Go, go, Norad. Uh, Spanner Canal is annoying but useless. Um, if they realign, I realign them in Nigeria. Probably, question mark. Um, I do need a coup. Guatemala is a perfect coup candidate. And that's one of the few a socialist governments for alignments. Alignments can go wrong, as in the past. Can also go right, we'll see. Ooh, that's big. Yeah, that's big enough. Um, so we need to coup. Let's move focus. Hopefully they don't roll high on this coup, which means I could counter coup with Panama. Or with Lone Gunman and UN. Lone Gunman UN is very nice. Um, yeah, if Lone Gunman wasn't a thing, I would definitely, definitely uh, UN Muslims. But it is a thing, uh, so I won't. Um, Muslims going to space. Uh, Korean War I can suffer. Fine with that. I'd rather not take the two additional points of damage if he beats for Central America for the domination but if it can't be helped it can't be helped we'll see it's one of those weird things about Central America only three battlegrounds but for the USSR it can be a lot of points and because like you've seen in the past there's, there's reasonable ways to actually get in there and stay in there Fidel for Cuba notwithstanding and there's two battlegrounds also adjacent to the US it also means that technically the US is easier to get into it, but Cuba is always a difficult thing with Fidel being around. Mm. Fidel being away is still not a good thing, but the late war there's still Ortega, which allows a USSR a coup in an adjacent region from like, Nicaragua, um, which means if you have influence in Cuba, then uh, things can go wrong. That's very nice, as expected. That's a coup there. That's cute. Okay, sure. Yeah. Um, Africa is still not safe, but I'll score Central America scoring for basically free. With pleasure. Pleasure, I tell you. Um, so yeah, most roughs definitely goes to space. Don't want none of that. Screen sells to space. Which means they still... So next turn is you and Lone Gunman. Oh yeah, it takes it out. Um, UN Lone Gunman Q Saharan states. I think almost always. I don't think that's a situation where I won't do that. Um, overprotecting Angola is probably good. Overprotecting Thailand could be good enough. Taking Burma might not be a bad idea. Oh, look, there's shuttle bank. Should have waited for the event. And there we go. I'm gonna end the discard. The last discard of the game. Which means it's basically done for. Which is very good for me. I must say. Uh, do we still bend? Another canal is the question. And what do we do with our last points there? Oh god, brush war again. 
I'm still going. Ooh, that was mm -hmm. interesting. Um, I think we still pop Panama Canal. The one point doesn't really do much. Could technically try realigning Nigeria. It isn't the worst, but I don't think I will. Maybe do this. It's a bit of a yeah. Again, if they had Italy, Europe would score for one more. Because I could take Turkey, Greece, Canada in a flick of a wrist. Just gonna offend Panama here. Um, have some more influence here. Have influence in Panama and Costa Rica. Allows me to get to Nicaragua or something like. They do go for the arms race VP, which is sensible. Um, but yeah. Uh, oh boy. Did get that. Um, so I think I like to break something. See the chili of Venezuela. Allende is still in there. But still. Two, three, four. Two, yeah. Definitely just chilly. Ooh, Iranian hostage crisis. Ooh, Butch. Butch is nice. I like Butch. Um, is there anything else to consider? Well, we can see what they do. But this hand is very, very bad if the, for them. Uh, Missile Envy would be annoying, and they might just do that. Especially with that card out. There's Aldrich Ames. Ooh. So now I have... Well... Huh. Do I allow them to take Africa away? Because I'll force them to, right? Like there's so many cards in here, but it's nothing bad, crucially bad for me. So if I just purge them, yeah, I would just purge them. Because it's it's Africa scoring. I ran. Like this, this AI war is nothing. Ortega is fine since I don't have anything in Cuba. Um, Kitchen debate doesn't do much, but we'll see. The main issue is Africa scoring is in a pickle for them. Um, obviously, they could take ABM, but even then, Africa scoring is still bad. Even if they successfully coup Angola or Zaire, probably Zaire, uh, because Angola is in a realignment position and realign out immediately. It's probably better for them to drop Africa, but yeah, I see, I see my point. Uh, Flower Power hasn't been played. Um, when did Flower Power happen? It didn't happen, did it? Was that one of the cards I dropped? Oh, probably one of the cards I dropped, yeah. yeah. Well, here you see how my short-term memory is very good. This thing needs to go to space. Yeah, that's Africa scoring as expected. Coup at Olympic Games. Where will they coup? Egypt. Ooh. Intriguing. Um, maybe I'm cooing Libya is cute, but not really great. ABM cooing of... Uh, is this not a time and space where we just go hamboni on Chile? Right. Um, do that for that. Um, just start overprotecting things. Probably fake Japan at some point. I think here it's just getting into Cuba. Getting into Cuba and making sure we can win there. Well, win. Tiebreak it, which is already enough of a win. Um, but yeah, my hand is not problematic. Um, perhaps... Yeah, if they do have Missile Envy, I should have probably played ABM. I'm assuming they don't have Missile Envy, but that might be a mistake. Um, let's go troll for the event, which is still fine. There's one, two, three, four, five, six. I can space Iranian. Um, I think we don't play it for the event. 
Um, that guy's fine. Just take this, right? Let me just take this. Again, if they had Missile Envy, they would have played it. So it's gum, but it's not. Oh, that's the event. Oh, quite nice. 2 VP. But probably better than that. So now is the time. Oh, wait, this is active. This is active. Cute. Um, no, no. Not gonna do that again. Done that in the past. Not gonna do that again. Um, so yeah, now the big question is do we queue anything in South America? Do we queue anything in Central America? Always a big question. Never sure what actually is the right answer. But um, yeah, Asia is too stable. Could say Libya, but Libya is technically 1vp potentially. Nicaragua mm. is very juicy. Uh, Nigeria, sorry. And also works on a 1. There you see why sometimes you use ABM for an Africa 1 snap coup. Even if you do roll a 1, it's not lost. Weird that you would space North Sea oil. I find that weird. Um, perhaps that's just me, but I'm low on cards regardless. There's no need for you to actually go, hmm. So I think I want to use Ortega. I need to start overprotecting things. Like John Paul to space is way better than... Oh yeah, but you're, you're perched, you're perched, you're perched, of course. Sorry, ignore my ignorance. Um, them being purged means things are a bit more sensible. Uh, I want to take Japan now. They have China. Um, so I want to start overprotecting these places. I should be overprotecting. Probably use an contra. Argentina. Argentina needs overprotection, Chile needs overprotection for sure. Um, the one in Japan is against... Wait, we haven't seen Japan again, have we? Ooh, Middle East scoring. Yeah, that stings. That definitely stings. Oh, I should have remembered the shuttle. Uh, Kuo on Libya then with ABM would have been more attractive. Mm -hmm. Do we do this? Um, Nah, I like Argentina and Cola. I think this is fair enough. I'm going to exit and re-enter to get rid of this bug where if you go too quickly, I'm cancelling a thing. These lovely signs stay up. There's no great realignment positions on me for them. Um, I will probably need to take Ivory Coast at some point. Like a coup in Siren State is quite good for them, but I can't really. You know, I've got Iranian hostage crisis. Um, probably won't give it to them. That's nice. No more Musrafs. Um, weirdly enough. No, no, this goes to space. Okay. What do we have? We've got terrorism, we've got five year plan, we've got special relationship, NATO isn't in effect. Still Regan. Yeah, this is just a good hand. Um EU is very strong, I must say. <laughs> we do have NATO. We could defend NATO and then special relationship for two VP. Huh. Is that ever the correct play? It is the correct play against missile envy. Weirdly enough. It is the correct play against missile envy. Um, you know what? I think that's what I'm gonna. Uh, I moved my one four up that I would want to use for Japan. It's not a thing I like. Let's go terrorism. Decal. Decal strikes fear in the hearts of. <laughs> wow. Um. <laughs> Of 
quite remarkable. I mean, this time Asia is good for me, but they've got Deco, which means they can take Thailand. Um, but they probably also want to focus on anywhere in Africa. But yeah, this, this I see as a take Thailand, Vietnam, break Nigeria, break South Africa, something like that. I don't know. They're still stuck with Foa in their hand, which is nice. They can't space it, which is nice. Uh, I should space sooner rather than later. Also true. Mm. And Japan should be mine. That being said, Asia's just been scored. And I could tie it out. It's just one of those weird things. Um, also, they use China uh, now for take Thailand. Um, ooh. They're not going for Thailand. Shoot. Good, good, good. Okay, so overprotect, overprotect, take back. This. Giving up Nigeria is fine. Che is annoying, we can go to space. Everything else is fine. What is my halt? Is the question. I'm asking myself. Iron Lady. Silly, silly Iron Lady. That card is such a weird ass card. It's a blue event, but it gives influence for the USSR. Um, don't think we can really do anything against that. So we go into space. Grab the VPs there. Okay, should have been done. This gives one VP, right? Yeah, it's only one VP. Petty. Ah, they did have South America scoring. <laughs> This time it didn't grab the good one, the good scoring, as it sounds. Um, so that means it's time for me to take Nigeria and overprotect some of these. Hmm. I think it's take Nigeria and take Peru. Um, Weirdly enough, I know, I know, I know. Take Costa Rica. Whatever thing to do, could be a thing to do. Could be a thing to do. Still looking forward to realigning France. Probably won't happen, but one day it might. Um, which region isn't scored yet? Europe. Uh, it's the only one. Okay, sure. I wonder whether they would have actually used China for Japan. If I perhaps that that would have been like it, they need to have Japan in order for that to happen, right? Which is unlikely, but possible. They are using the China card. They are going for Japan. Wow, that's ballsy. Um, do we allow them to take Japan here? I think EU is too strong to allow them to take Japan, but fight free. You can make it more annoying on them and then spend the three on something like that. Yeah, none of this is stable, but that's fine. Um, I need, still need to coup. There's three more ARs left. EU is definitely lost, they are getting them out of, well, making Poland and East Germany very weak. Ooh, war games. No war games for us. Too bad. Okay. It's not lost, they are. Because they're building up in Yugoslavia. Ah. Uh, that still is, isn't it? Still is. We're just gonna coup Uruguay. To coup we need. So coup we must show. I lost both Argentina and Japan there. Which is definitely not good. That being said, I'm definitely in the lead. Well definitely currently in the lead. Um, see how long that takes. Ooh, event. Um what's the worst that happens? I put three here. I'm not discarding. 
not discarding. Chili is bad regardless. Um, Uh, yeah, yeah, that's what I do. I'll get rid of that card. Europe is the only thing that's not scored. This might entice them to take Yugoslavia or something like that. Right, just interesting. Oh, they need a space cow. Nice. They did succeed. Uh, let's see, let's see. Um, or we do Yugoslavia. I think I like this technically, but it's not better, right? Never is. That's good enough. Okay, I've got Japan, which is very good. Um, I got Flower Power to give them with four Missile Envy, very good. Puppets is not that great, but it's still fine, weirdly enough. Um, puppets three line in Cuba. Duck and cover, but it's too risky, I think. Um, not necessarily things that are really bad, but don't need to do that, I think, is the thing. Um, alternatives. Uh, Ains has been gone. Your Japan is happening regardless. It's only Europe scoring to think of. Let's let's see what cards are there that actually would not like this. There's, there's nothing there. Don't mm -hmm. cover it is. Marine Barrack bombing. Not bad. Gives them a jet. I can accept that. I can respect that. Whatever you call it. Um, flower power is still happening. Yeah. Breath has been gone twice. Only this Aeon. There's no war game cards in my hand. US Japan is very strong. What's the card we're not playing? This probably. Japan is fine. There's Glasnost, but for influence. Okay. So we're taking this. Uh, YouTube is late, if at all. Well, probably late. Um, Alliance for Progress isn't. Happening. So we're just doing this and overdeckt question mark. Um, overdeck Angola. South African unrest is still in there, which can make Angola a pain. Um, yeah. That's bear trap they need to space. Space is this card spot, so it doesn't matter. For me at least. Yeah, Japan is definitely something I want to ace later. The number of faults is fine, but again, shouldn't want to do that soon. Flower power is a lot. You can puppets them into doing some funky stuff. Uh, this is good. Anything else I would puppet? Yeah, go to Finland. <laughs> yeah, no, I don't think so. Uh, yep, let's go. Puppets make Central America a dangerous place to be. Potentially get them out of Africa, although that's unlikely to actually happen. Ooh, Nixon for 2 VP. That's a tough hand on them, clearly. Um, obviously, counter clean. Middle East has been neutralized, which is fine. Ooh, colonial rear guards. Overprotect, 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 overprotect. Yes. <laughs> Very straightforward. And they could Nicaragua, I assume. Going South African states at a certain point is also good, but they probably could come around before that. So I've got one AR that I play use Japan. Mm. Gonna do that. Um, I can cook? Yeah, I can cook. 
I want to play you in Japan to seal the deal. Um, yeah, well fought. Um, don't think there's anything that can royally curse me right now. Yeah, doubt it. Wow, we also had solidarity. That's that's whack. Yeah, luck wasn't on their side. Mm, let's see what we can snatch Europe. has been played. <laughs> well, last day are probably doesn't matter much. How much is presence here? Just one. Um, it's obviously Vietnam, Vietnam doesn't do anything, breaking this, that's uh, already even, doing that is probably fine, uh, breaking Cuba is way, way better, it doesn't matter much. <laughs> 